In a Sioux Falls teacher is getting statewide recognition. George Hawkins is South Dakota's Teacher of the Year. Hawkins has been an educator for 12 years and currently teaches social studies at Jefferson High School. Kellan's Julia Lynn introduces us to South Dakota's Teacher of the Year. Mr. Hawkins is not only Sioux Falls Teacher of the Year, he is now South Dakota's Teacher of the Year. I just had no words. Um, I, I, it was just extremely humbling and grateful because uh, I know that you know in this district, in this building, like there's amazing teachers everywhere and in this state. Uh, like the other finalists that I got to meet, they, they're awesome individuals. Hawkins says the support from his school is overwhelming. Right, like I kind of like to stay back in the shadows and, and not necessarily get attention. And so it, it's, it's kind of been a, a weird day, uh, but it's, it's been really nice. Like all of the students, you know, have been coming up to me. Hey, Mr. Hawkins, congrats. Jason Curry Olson has taught beside Hawkins since even before they moved to Jefferson. He walked in incredibly capable. I think having the background that he has in, in law and also just the personality and then the persona that he carries into the classroom, he is so competent in his content. Project-based learning is a style Hawkins utilizes in his classroom. This allows us to really showcase something that we got going on that's pretty good here at Jefferson and we have project-based learning and George has been a pioneer from the word go in project-based learning. It started at New Tech High School. Hawkins is honored by the awards, but says making students feel welcome is the best honor of them all. At the end of the day, I, I think about the, the teachers I had in high school, uh, and I don't necessarily remember the content. I remember how I felt in that classroom, and I knew that I belonged there. In Sioux Falls, Julia Lynn, Kelloland News. Hawkins has a law degree. He will represent South Dakota for the National Teacher of the Year Award that will be announced next spring in Washington, D.C.